Hello and welcome back to episode 30 of Ottoman Domination. We're playing as the Caliphate in EU 4th 1.35 Ottoman Update and the Domination DLC. We are working our way through the Ottoman's glorious new mission tree. And, um... You know, we are at a point where... There's definitely a few things we need to do, such as destroying the Holy Roman Empire. We need to invade Northern Italy. Do all that kind of fun stuff. We have our strong march in the north, um, so I probably could break the Holy Roman Empire pretty easily with a little bit of shenanigans by allying electors, and most of them should be pretty willing to join me, uh, Nassau being one that is very hesitant. So let's start off with trying to get Nassau to like us more. So we'll send them some influence. And also we'll do the same with Strasbourg. And then we'll start allying up electors. So, it's going to cost us some Diplo points in the short term, but it will make our life fairly easy overall. Now, why did that change? It just said they would all ally me, now they hate me. I did not calculate my hegemon status right away, I guess. It's going to make dismantling the HRE a little annoying. Well, we'll work on getting them all allied then. Can do what we can to influence them all. Send you guys a gift. That'll do that. Go ahead and improve relations with you. Can ally you guys. And we'll start improving relations with you guys. enough to get you. You guys are still very resistant. Who is the current emperor, by the way? Did I look at that? The Palatinat. So I... I made a mistake allying them. Whoopsies. So we're going to need to wait five years then to do this. I just assumed it was Austria. I mean, I guess it doesn't actually matter. Because... I can just get them into a war anyway. Okay, and then... So... You, 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 and you. So we just need you guys. Who's the pallet to not run? Well, I can't. I'm not going to be able to co them because of that issue I did. Well, start improving relations. Can stop with some of them other ones. And then 
go ahead and uh, send a scornful insult your way. Just doing whatever we can to get our relations up with these guys a little faster. Although being allied to Lip is not helping. Who's Austria allied to? They're allied to Dortmund, so I can co-belligerate Dortmund to get you guys in. Who's Dortmund allied to? Staria as well. Should have planned this a little bit better. Keep doing what we can to boost up our relations with these guys then. And let's go ahead and get our units in position as we will storm the Austrians pretty quickly here. And we're going to have to deal with the Commonwealth as well, but that should not be that much of an issue. Yeah, we won't build that. That's fine. We don't need it. Uh, I guess we will use our money in the meantime to upgrade another great project as well as start spamming out town halls. Which will do quite a bit for our governing capacity, even though I think we are in a pretty good spot with it already. Okay, ally you. Yeah, you guys, it doesn't matter. Now, okay, so... We are allied to... Saxony. To Strauss... or Upoli. To Strasbourg. To Nassau, we are not allied to you, and we are allied to you, but when we co Dortmund, you are going to end up in the war. So, declare war. Palatinat will not join. Well, that ruins everything, doesn't it? If I co Dortmund, you still won't help. Well, that's annoying. Oh, they're allied to Saxony, too. I'm going to have to do this the hard way anyway, aren't I? Very, very annoying that they won't defend them. I should have planned that a little better. Uh, da, 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 da. I could attack them and just hope that they'll change their minds. I 
I, I got I gotta say, I really gotta say, uh, Palatinot, I'm a little disappointed in you guys because it's kind of messed up. You won't help your uh, fellow uh, subjects. Pretty messed up, if I do say so myself. Keep moving towards legalism. We are capped out on admin points, so stability is capped out as well. I guess that means our best option is to just spend them. There we go. Get you over here, get you over here. Go ahead and get you up up here, no, uh, over here. About right there. I'm just going to white piece out the Commonwealth, get them out of this war. I don't want to have to deal with them. Go ahead and pile in on them. Advisor cost, I'll, I'll take that. Pile in on this army. Pile in on this army. It's a long way around, but we'll do it. I wonder if I can attack someone else in the Empire, even though... Colin Saxony into this war. Can I call them in? No, I can't, but that's fine. Let's do that. Let's not piece anyone out. I'll get a quick uh, reason to fight these guys. And then... We use that as a reason to... get into this war. Take some intercolonial trade. 
uh, we'll go ahead and spam down town halls. And we'll upgrade the Brandenburg Gate for Brandenburg as well, or for the uh, Prussians. as much damage to their armies as we can they are invading our core territory so let's get back here and deal with them there you get onto there. Of course they're going to win that siege way quicker than you should. I'll take it back instantly. And then let's get up here and deal with them here. Make our claim. Where is my main fleet? They are out here attritioning. I'm going to send them up here so that we can get on to that province as well. Okay, we'll get up here. I will start piecing out people that don't really matter, such as Castans. That'll just lessen the... Oh, we got no manpower either. This might have been a huge mistake trying to uh, break the HRE at this point. There. Jesus. Alright, if we... That'll decrease our absolutism by one. Sure, let's do it. We'll do this. We'll come over here. We'll do this. Let's go ahead and abandon legalism. And then we are going to... Take that, and then we are going to get ourselves some manpower. We're going to go ahead and spend as many of these as we can on manpower. It's not a lot, but it's something. And then we'll go through and boost our stability back up. Get over to Prague. Get down here and continue dealing with the Austrians. 
Dith Martian Dortmund is ours. We dealt with these guys. Okay, I'm going to do this war now. The Palatinate will join. To dismantle, we just need Heidelberg. And then their subjects, or their uh, the other electors. So Heidelberg and Saxony. So we'll send you down this way. Lipa, I do not want to get you out. Uh, Dortmund would be fine. Dith Martian would also be fine. go ahead and bring these guys back here. And how about you guys make your way up this direction? They're our ally. You're also our ally. Strasbourg is our ally. So yeah, I think we just need these two capitals and we can dismantle the HRE. it is fine and um, let's go ahead and work on some more of this I know that uh, they were weak, but if I'd have jumped into that before, I probably could have won it. Blow the walls there. I'd very much like to blow the walls in Heidelberg, too. Okay, there's Dresden. We're worth like half of Europe at this point, but it is fine. Uh, let's get on to this fort. And how about you guys get on to that fort? Actually, just get on to the one that you're real close to. Alright, let's just... Make sure, okay. Veridan, we can piece you out. I'm just going to take your money. Wraps trade power and a rivalry. Thank you. All I need is Heidelberg. I'm about to get stack wiped. Yeah, I got nowhere to run. A 
Horrid. That was the wrong province. Okay, there we go. Heidelberg is ours, which means dismantle the HRE. Boom. Uh, we were at the Monarch Point cap, but it don't matter. Uh, 25 permanent power projection is awesome. We cannot take anything. We're already capped out here. Have we done our mercantilism yet? I'm just going to go ahead and boost up our mercantilism. That's fine. Get that up as high as we can, and then we'll spend the rest on some development. And then I can peace out Austria. I am going to take... What I have claims on, which is right here. It's going to irritate some people, but the HRE no longer exists, so it doesn't matter. Piece that war out just to get it out. And then I will probably even just white piece these guys if they would accept it, but they won't. So we're going to have to deal with the... rest of the Empire. You guys, I could probably piece you out, though. No? Just about. How about you get up here onto Lubeck? Yeah, what's really doing the damage to us is just the sheer amount of troops we got involved with. Real good thing I, I went for that white piece right away with the um, Commonwealth, though, in this situation. That should be more than enough to get these guys out. No? Really? You're going to make me siege down your whole country? This is being so wonky right now. Okay, there we go. Get them out. And there's more Lubeck, Thuringia, Landshut. Uh, I guess I'll keep moving towards Mysticism for the time being, because that was a nice boost to our manpower pool. Lubeck, just get out of this war, please. One of the nicest things about destroying the HRE is watching it just collapse afterwards. As all the countries vie for the scraps that are left. Oh, I should probably core those provinces, correct? to their provinces. Uh, with all of this money, we should be doing something with it, right? So we'll continue to build these up. Town halls are useful in that they don't take up building slots and they let us get more government administration going. 
So that is always a nice thing. Alright, so we built all those. And now I am just looking to... I have this army here too. Let's really ram down on these guys. Take care of that. Get you guys up here. Okay, we just need to finish this up. You're going to lose this war. You should realize that. Take the trade power. Um, is there anyone else worth sieging? There we go. White piece. That's all I wanted. Uh, dismantling the HRE was the goal there anyway. We will bring our armies. Back home so that they can regroup for our next conflict in the next game. So uh, if you are liking the series, I'd appreciate a like. If you really are liking the series, I would appreciate a subscription. And I really hope to see you in the next one. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye.